do you do? Welcome back to the heart of Atlanta at OTE Arena for another edition of Overtime Elite Basketball. We've got the 2-0 YNG Dreamers and Eli Ellis and the R and RWE and Day players are ready. Dave, Tom, are you ready? I'm so ready right now. I uh, I think we had a little center there, they, a little miscommunication. They were going to dab each other up, and Big Nate said, no, thank you. Tough start. Tough start. Tom, who do you have winning this? Look, man, I love RWE. I love Cam and Nelson, but I got to stick with the Ellis brothers. I'm going with the YNG Dreamers. They're going to make, they're gonna shoot 73s tonight and probably make around 40 of them. Carter Knox, cash. Who you got? <laughs> uh, that cute. Man, it's tough. I got to go Dreamers, bro. Hey. Wow. Yo, Santo is big, man. He's a, he's a big time game changer. Yeah, we didn't talk about it a ton in the in the beginning, but obviously Santo Surreal, the Kentucky commit, as Isaac Ellis. Ellis, right? Wilkins. Ooh. Ooh. Right back at him. Getting it going early here at the OTE. We're looking forward to see how that matchup shakes out. Fast Carter break. knocks on the fast break off the backboard. That was kind of crazy. I'm not going to lie, Tom. Yeah, go right at Isaac if you're Carter Knox and finish at the rim. Although Carter not, I mean, uh, Isaac Jay Ellis. Jack. Jack. Isaac Ellis does take about 90 charges a game. I got oh, everybody can shoot threes today. Everybody <laughs> I love it. Very interesting. Coach Frazier is rocking with the same starting lineup that he won last game. Starting with Darian Sutton coming off the bench, which I like. Gives him a little offense. As Don Lewis. Dirt Road. The nickname Dirt Road is crazy. Snipe, you like that nickname? <laughs> hey, that might be the best nickname. Miller. He wanted his own team. He said, I want the pressure. So he took the Dreamers back to North Carolina, teamed up with his brother, teamed up with his dad, and his family business, as everyone knows with them, as Carter Knox. Oh, jeez. Got a pile of bottles on the floor. Right mm. Anthony Edwards, AE. AE. I see it. I see it. I believe he's wearing Anthony Edwards shoes as well tonight. Not only the James Harden oh, final set, man. Oh, what a great. pass. Damn oh, oh, Sutton. Ah. With authority. Ooh. Darion Sutton off the bench with a big dunk. He's got his college commitment coming up very soon. Probably in the next week or so, we're going to find out where Darion is going to commit. And some college is going to be very happy. Do you have any insider information? I do. Oh. As big dunk. Michigan visit. As much as it hurts me, oh, it looks like he had too much of a good time. Oh, beautiful from Davis to Knox with the touch pass back to Big 32. Pass it to Isaac, deep three. Yeah, a big bonus is a nightmare for RWE right now. OTE no, Splash Bros. The OTE <laughs> Splash Bros. Knox way too open. Can't leave that man. Break, so they put on the six foot nine, six foot ten Darian Sutton to give him some length. Oh, good luck. Extra pass. Yeah, I, I, I think I'm going to agree with Tom. The game plan, it looks like, from RWE is to make anybody else score outside of Eli Ellis. Oh, why? You can't do that. Eli. Oh, no foul. It's no crazy. foul. Knox going the other way. Oh. Take a picture of it. Eli's not going to get a more open shot than that. Carter Knox with a big Two finish. seconds. Throws it up. Off the backboard. W.E. with a seven-point lead after one, holding Eli to no points. Take another look at this crazy poster attempt from Big Nate. Entertaining first quarter. Don't go anywhere. More OT action coming up next. If you can still hear us, but you obviously coached Eli Ellis over the summer with RWE. He played for you before he was playing out here for the Dreamers. As Lincoln Cosby is talking to RWE, talking to OTE. What, what are your thoughts on Nelson? Where's he at tonight? I don't, I don't like him. I don't know where he's at. Uh, I could care less. I don't really like him. Woo! I don't like his hair. Oh, uh, sudden. Who can we look at? I'm already Evan. I like that. What do you think about him? Do you like his game? He'd be a good, good addition. I like his defense and I like his energy. I think that's something we need. Isaac on the floor. Nice finish. Cam, last question for you, man. You guys hope we win this game tonight. You pull the two and two. Are you guys the number one team in all of OTE after that? I think we stay at number two. City Reapers, until they lose, I think we stay at two. Quan Davis gives RWE a 12-point lead. Cam, we appreciate you joining us, my guy. Thank you, guys. You guys look great on the broadcast, too. Oh, Cam. Cam. Cam, making us blush. Go RWE! Let's go RWE! Come on, RWE! I was riding with you with RWE, don't worry. Isaac, for three. Yo, 
Courtney says J Jack. Uh, Nari the Phantom says J Jack. A lot of J Jack fans here. Jason Sobrano says Trey Parker. I'm a J Jack fan. I, I like him as well. Lincoln Cosby and one. Hey, this might be Lincoln Cosby's little coming out party here. He's got five points. The freshman, the number two ranked freshman in the whole entire country. Number 13, Lincoln Cosby. A phenom, if I've ever seen one. Take another look. Pretty Morrow, Kansas commit, Rakeez Passmore, who we just saw, and the Blue Checks visit the O to take on the best score in the nation, Carter Knox. Tune in December 15th at 7 p.m. Eastern. We got big bonus time. Knox to Davis. All oh, the finishing traffic. A man amongst boys. Flex on him. Hit the quad. The soundboard goes crazy at the O, Tom. Speaking of Quan, we got OT. Carter Knox throws it up, gets his own board, and finishes and the foul, just as they drew it up, Sniper Jones. Hey, listen, I would accuse him of patting this down. Got it, go, go, go. Bolo. Lewis. Kicks it. Abu. Oh, wow. Abu always bringing the energy and always talking to the refs. Always hot, hot, hot. talking to the refs. Uh, what do you think about a fan hot. having their flashlight on filming this game? Don't I think love flashlight that. Flashlight is a no go. Don't we love got that. Great lighting here. Quan, hit me. Quan Davis traffic, traffic. from deep behind the arc. And this is why I say he's one of the most underrated scorers here, averaging 18 points. But he's so known for his defense, it can get overlooked. Great pass by yeah. Davis. Davis right going now. the other way. Stutters to the rack. Oh, oh, J-Jack, 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 Why? You could not tell me at the beginning of this game that Eli Ellis would be going to half with zero points. Amazing job defensively by RWE. J-Jack, wow. Wow. Game score to zero is crazy. Quan, floater. Great. Pretty wow. finish. Quan wow. Davis, two seconds. Goes it if up. he hits that, oh. And RWE goes up by 18 to end the first half. Tom, I couldn't have seen this coming. And I picked RWE, but I did not see an 18-point lead at halftime. I thought RWE could come out and dominate, right? They have a lot more size on the Dreamers. They're coming off of a good win, but I did not see them holding Eli Ellis at zero points. I mean, it's almost close considering that. We're now joined by Quan Davis. Quan, great first half. What was going right for you guys in that first half to have an 18-point lead at halftime? I feel like we was hitting the shots when we needed them. We were playing great defense. We sticking together. Talk about the pride you take in your defense. Right now, you're holding Eli to zero points. I take a lot of pride on my defense. I know a lot of people gas this matchup up, up, so I'm taking advantage of it. Now, when you're really focusing on defense, a lot of players go kind of quiet on offense. Right now, you have 14 points in the first half. How locked in do you feel on that side of the floor? I mean, I'm just hitting over shots. They swinging the ball. I'm being able to knock it down. Quan, good luck in the second half. Appreciate you stopping by. Appreciate you. That's Quan Davis with 14 first half points, holding Eli to no points. Hey, if you think RWE is going to run away with this, you're crazy. YNG Dreamers. They'll be coming back in the second half. Stick with us for the OTE Halftime Show. Overtime Tom, Sniper Jones, bringing you all the action coming up next. RWE up 54-36 at half. Welcome back to the OTE halftime. We just seen an amazing half of basketball. Tom, what do you think about that first half? I'm pretty speechless, honestly. Like watching Daquan Davis methodically just crush Eli Ellis has been unbelievable. We keep talking about it, but Daquan having 14 points, Eli having zero. The Dreamers being in the game up until like those last couple minutes, Isaac Ellis really shouldering the load. It was a good first half, but it if the Dreamers want any chance here, Eli's gonna have to flip a switch. Not only is Eli gonna have to be engaged, I feel like 
Coach got to draw him up something. They trapping him every time he gets the ball off a pick and roll situation. So I can't really even say it's because of lack of effort. He just hasn't been getting a chance to get open looks. As you mentioned, Carter Knox, but more importantly, Daquan Davis is doing it on both ends of the ball. Guarding their best player, but still contributing a lot on the offensive end, Tom. Totally. And then look, there was a lot of three-point shooting in that first half. I don't know how many they made. It felt like a billion. You saw Big Don Lewis, you saw Jason Jackson. But Carter Knox with his mid-range game, we talked about it a little bit. I don't know if I've ever seen a high school basketball player be able to hit mid-range shots like that. So he started it. Taquan's leadership brought us over at the top. And they've looked better and better every single game this season. Starting out 0-2, losing Sompto, and now winning their last game in the City Reapers and looking great tonight. Uh, Eli, look, this is me and you talking right now, man. Okay, you got zero points right now. You're the leading scorer with 37 a game. You got this. Okay, I have faith in you. You are going to be the person that brings this team back. Isaac can hit some more shots. I still think Isaac can drop a cool 30. We need Eli to get, get going here. Get going early and quick. Can we cut this to like an 8 to 10 point game going into the fourth? That's what we need to do. You're not going to get it all back early. No, no, here we go. Here we go. Hey, here's guys, what we do. And guys, I know we said pull up, pull up, to shoot. Pull up. Oh, that's all him. Oh, we out. We in. Let's go, go, Eli. Dreamer. Hey, you know, now that the Dreamers are North Carolina, Sniper, do you think it's fitting that, you know, Dreamville is based in North Carolina and the Dreamers oh, yeah. are in North Carolina, Sniper? I like that. They had Darian Sutton on them for a little bit. Now they back to Daquan Davis. I'd open. Eli. Ooh. Come on. Come on. Get Start up on him. He's got eight. Eli Ellis is starting to percolate. Woo! RWE pushing the pace. Looking for his dishes. Crawford back out. Knox. Front of the rim. Oh, give it up. Finish that. Eli. Easy lay. There you go. Oh, and Eli Ellis is fired up, Tom. I don't blame him. Ten quick points in under four minutes. Oh, oh, oh. The handles now you gotta spins. Fade away. Oh, no. oh, that's not his shot. I was about shot. to say, that's, that's Kobe Bryant. That's Jack Frost. <laughs> Pretty leg. I still need Jay to ask, Jack. why does J-Jack wear 99? We got to find out. Yo, he might have the most effortless bounce. He said that's because it's a, he said that's his overall. Jeez. I love that. Ooh, Burton. Ty Burton. Hey, Tom. Ty Burton has an offer from the school named Elon University. Oh, shout out to Elon. I know a lot of great people have went there. Who do you know? My friend, well, actually, my sisters went there. Yeah, both your, both your sisters went there. <laughs> and, uh, and you went there as well. And I did go there. <laughs> Ty Burton, come on home. Come be a Phoenix, Ty Burton. Hit more threes like that. He looks exactly like an Elon Phoenix. Damn, ball. that's hurtful. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. 13 straight points. I, I expect this to be a quick break. Yes. I mean, he's not even sitting down there. <laughs> if you look at Eli down there, Sutton. He's basically oh, on the court. Finish. And hey, Isaac obviously came out to a quick 18 points in the first half, but we haven't seen a lot from him. So let's see if he can uh, shoulder the load while his brother's out. Hey, I, Ooh, I'll talk to Coach Frazier. Coach Frazier wants to explore the mismanagement of Darian Sutton being guarded by Ty Burns. Yes. Back, move back. He's bleeding, dirty three, he's bleeding. Ty Burns got to be what, five foot seven. He's guarding uh, Darian Sutton. That's uh, not a great, great matchup for the Dreamers. Ty Burns is five foot eight. Lancaster, PA. Data. Carter Knox. Oh, that might be going the other way. And one. And one. Tonight, good call. Crossing over. Dancing. Prancing. Oh, oh, projected. Oh, I thought that was bull time. I did too. Quad kicks. Big Nate with the finish. That's Eli. Way too much space. Stay here. Isaac. Isaac, the lefty. Same team. Great, great, great on the board. boards right now. Oh, why don't we? Eli. Hit me, Eli Ellis. That's just hard work there. That's just them outworking RWE, getting multiple offensive rebounds with a much smaller team, and eventually you find a wide open Eli Ellis to drain one. Number 15 is up to 17 on the game. All in this quarter. All in this quarter. Claude Davis says, hey. you have some of that, I'll take some of this. We point guards, man. We might have to nickname Quan the answer. <laughs> Every time oh. something happens. Oh. 
He got the answer for you. I love that. Eli, Isaac, to the rim. Oh. Hey, these guys are playing now. Like, Turned this off. Is, oh. Eli, a little out of control. Oh, where to keep it? Lose oh, it. Oh, it. Devin gets it. Four seconds left. What a pass. Last cross with the finish. And RWE wow. pushes it back out to a 10-point lead. What a flurry of action in the final 90 seconds here, Tom. Daquan Davis is unbelievable. Like, gets the steal, gets the pass. Talking to his teammates, he, man. They're, all these guards are playing amazing, I love it. Back and forth action here at the O. You're not gonna wanna miss this fourth quarter. 10 point game, RWE YNG Dreamers. Don't go anywhere. Down here in the corner, I think about both of them pushing off when they're on offense. 10 point game here at OTE Arena. Bolo, hey, Don Lewis. He's, road. he's awesome. He has one of the prettier jumpers I've seen. I'm not going to lie. I might have a new favorite player. <laughs> Carter, Carter Knox. Oh, he doesn't miss that. Come, Come on now. On now. Leo. Come on now. Chuck says hamburgers. Keep eating. As ham hamburgers. Yes. Oh, Sudden with the finish. Yeah. How, how many burgers would you have in one set? Like a normal. Like Good. Live. Stay. Nice. Stay up. Coach Fraser in your ear right now. Switch it, switch it! High end! The switch is interesting. Lewis. Hey, oh, three right here. Jay Jack the going the other way. Oh, he's coming from behind him. Ty Burns coming from behind. Oh, 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 Jay Jack! One way Jack. What? Hey, Woo! switch it. Switch it. That boy is special. What? That J Jack bounce is crazy. Snipe, you had a great view of that. Hey! Oh, 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 you caught it. Will Hawkins. I thought you were gone. Oh, tied. Elite, elite. Right here, come on, come J Jack's caught a lot back, of nice dunks. Quick, he famously dunked green, on Sando in preseason. Yo. And that was enough for me. Green it, green I would have never jumped get out, get out. after that. Woo. Green it, green it. I can't hear the word Hawkins without thinking of Stranger Things. Yeah, I was thinking his first followers ever. Really? Yeah, it's very interesting. Burden off the mark. You know that's based on a real story? What's his character in Stranger Things? Frost. Nice finish. Uh, They're uh, running off with a lead, man. I don't know. Just an unbelievable block here. You think he's beat? Says not so fast, Tom. Yeah, man, Eli thought he was going to get one off on him, but he forgot that he had a 6'10 wing who's super athletic chasing behind him. Darion Sun, one of the best defenders in all of OTE, the lockdown, the cash app lockdown of the game. We love to see it. See it. Shout out to cash app, man. Back to you. <laughs> it's nice to look honest person ever. <laughs> I just feel like even though they're clawing in, that you made a good point. RWE responds, man. They can never get lower than that eight point deficit. Nice finish, Ooh, man. Juan Davis up to 22. And look, Quan Davis and Carter Knox at 55 of RWE's 84 points. Pretty good. Yeah, that's a pretty good duo right there. And just remember, this team is missing Sampto right now. Oh, what? Eli. See, and that's why Eli could not do that. Story story and thank you very much. <laughs> no. One of my favorite big bonuses ever, a lot to yourself. Just like a Tracy. Just the range jumper. He genuinely looks confused. You almost threw a tantrum, baby. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no idea. Wait a minute. Came out. I always hit that shot. Eli. That's finish. tough, bro. What? That's crazy. What? Up to 21 on the game for Eli. Dude was just a catch and shoot player last year. Now he's doing up and under school blade. The ball control is really crazy. I think. Sudden. A oh, pretty finish, lefty. He's nice, bro. Just clearly taking advantage of the right way. You don't want to be in the dog with Daquan. Big Don's like, I'm sorry, man. <laughs> if you see Daquan fighting the bear, help the bear. <laughs> Knox. Oh. Ooh. Hey, sniper. Hey, Mr. Carter. 
Tell me where. Let us know what your question is, man. I will try to find it the best I possibly can. I like that quick bucket right there. Energy Tom, who's taking the shot? Uh, Barry on time. <laughs> a little late there. Oh, pack it up, pack it in. I don't know why they don't do that every big bonus. It feels easy to get at some point. point. Eli with 25, Isaac with 22, Don Lewis. Man, the time. Hey, this dude is automatic, bro. It's, it's actually uh, between the blue no, no, checks no, no. and YMG nothing, Dreamers. Nothing. Who has the best play? Oh! Eli Floater. Oh, Yo, Quan is up getting everything. Ah, Eli down. Yeah, Eli down right now. Quan, the first guy over to check him out. I was about to ask you a question before and got interrupted by that crazy dunk by Knox. Between the Dreamers and the Blue Checks, who is the best player? Look, you I think it's Eli because I think the Dreamers are literally zero without him. But if I'm going with best player, right now I think it's just the game of what, 30, 34 points? 34. Morton. Oh. oh. Four point play. Oh. Uh oh. Cosby. There you go, Lincoln. Bro, Lincoln Cosby, remember the name, one of the best freshmen in the country, the phenom. You know how hard it is to be on RWE as a freshman, in OTE as a freshman. Him, Jaden Wilkins, they're both doing it to Harry Miller, obviously on the City of Reaper. Shout out to the, to the class of freshmen down here in Atlanta. And that will do it. RWE holds on to win this one. 107-92. Exciting game. Tom, your thoughts? Um, look. The Dreamers had a tough first half. Eli scoring zero points. I think that third quarter is obviously where they want to be. When he's scoring like that, it opens up shots for Isaac, big Don Lewis. But I mean, they're gonna, they're gonna struggle with the size factor and with the athleticism factor. And if Daquan Davis is gonna play like this, we talked about the MVP. I, forget, I didn't mention Daquan Davis, but I mean, you can't talk about anyone being more valuable to their team right now with what he did against Eli on the offensive and defensive side. Unbelievable. And you're seeing the matchup right here. The matchup lived up to the hype. 27 for Eli, 22 for Quan. I thought the first half was really Quan who won that matchup. And yep. Eli, especially in that third quarter, really took off. Finishes with 27. And our very own Sniper Jones is down there with Quan Davis right now, the player of the game. Snipe, take it away. Yes, sir. I got my boy Quan with me. Great W today. They came in undefeated, but y'all got that W. How I feel? So great. You know, to get another win on our belt coming into it, too. Uh, yeah, it's so good. <laughs> now, once again, we've seen it on full display. Not only locking up on defense, but getting buckets on the other end. What was the thought process tonight? Um, you know, I was just being able to make plays for my team. Like you said earlier, I think it was because of you. You know, me and you talked earlier. He said he could shoot better than me. I had to prove him. <laughs> All right, man. Well, hey, great game. I'm tuned in to see what you guys got in store tomorrow. I appreciate you. Back to you guys at the booth. 22, nine and eight for number five, Quan Davis, your player of the game. RWE wins this one by 15, 107 to 92. A great night at the O. Stay with us tomorrow night. We'll, we will be back with more action for Sniper. For Tom, I'm Alex. Overtime day. See you tomorrow night. Back here at the O. Peace.